Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Your girl Brittany here with BB's Crafts. I am so super stoked to be a part of this collab who is hosted by Scrap Passion 01 Betty. And this is a pastelloween collab. Uh, myself and Betty and plus other wonderful crafty ladies are going to make some great pastelloween projects for you. Everybody has different flares, styles, and tastes, and I'm so excited to see what they create, and I'm excited for you guys to see what I have created. So this collab begins today and will run every Saturday until September 6th at 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. But because there was quite a few ladies who wanted to participate, there is another lineup that will participate on Sundays. So after you watch the ladies today, don't forget to check out tomorrow for the rest of the ladies who are part of this collab as well. And make sure you are following along because some of us may be doing a giveaway and I, myself, this channel will be doing a giveaway. So in order to participate in that, I will have that information down below in the description box, but make sure that you are a subscriber, 18 plus, and are commenting on videos, and I mean every video, because you'll never know if I will have a hidden giveaway. So the overall giveaway, for the at the very end, I will give one of my fun subscribers $25 PayPal credit into your account but again like I said make sure you're commenting on all videos because I may have a hidden giveaway in those videos as well so you will never know so to kick off this first week I want to show you one of my I think one of my overall favorite projects so stay tuned guys so this is what I created for my week one project as some of you may know I don't think I really said it so much on my channel I've gotten into macrame and I absolutely love doing it and it's just something that you can just sit down and do it's calming and relaxing and so I absolutely love it so I wanted to tie that in to one of these projects for the collab and so I made a Halloween one and this is for like a wall hanging or you can use it as your door display like you know like instead of a wreath or anything like that I personally am going to use it as a wall hanging inside of my craft room and I absolutely love how it turned out so what I did was kind of constructed in a way where this was like the body of the skeleton and this is like the little actual body part and then like here are the arms over here kind of ordeal now the pumpkin head and the hands I got from Michael's and they do have them this year so i'm pretty sure if you go there they'll have them all set out for you and these cute black roses with the eyeballs i got that from dollar tree and then these little flowers here are actually what comes on the skeleton hands and i just took those off and added it as decoration around the wall hanging itself and then if we look closely I have these little crocheted applique pumpkins that I did as well and then these pumpkins I also crocheted and then this one's purple with a pink top and then pink with the purple top and then again um, I use or I had cut out the words boo on my cameo and I did this like fun texturized type paper that I got from AC Moore before it had clothes and then also with the bouquet of flowers it came with these little spiders on there so I decided to put that inside the body of the skeleton and um, just act like it was crawling up so I wanted to still give it kind of like that little creepy spook type deal but still wanted to be fun and cutesy as well and then the skeleton it does come on a pick as well as the hands and this comes on the skeleton as well if you are wanting to go out and pick one up for yourself at michael's i absolutely love it i think it turned out super cute i do have everything wrapped around on this stick here it's um a real stick that i got outside in our yard and everything so 
yeah, I absolutely love it. I hope you guys love it too. Make sure that you like the video and comment down below. And if you want to be part of my giveaway, make sure you use the word spooky in your comment, spelled S-P-O-O-K-Y. And that is what I'm going to use to decipher who will be the winner of the overall giveaway. But again, like I said, make sure that you are watching and commenting on all videos because you never know if I'll have a hidden giveaway. Make sure you check out who's next, who is Anne, and she's Crafty Kimchi here on YouTube. And I can't wait to see what she has made as well as the other ladies. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!